What way do sanctions impact on women and on women's families? We don't hear enough about that in Australia. Uh, first of all, the sanctions against Syria are, really, are truly unilateral measures uh, that were taken by the United States uh, without uh, any uh, UN uh, approval or Security Council resolutions. Uh, so they are uh, um, uh, measures which were forced by the United States on Syria and forced on other countries to abide by, uh, which is really against any law in the world, against any international law, against any human law, uh, really. Um, of course, they affected not only women, they affected children, they affected families, particularly the ill, because uh, they prevented, for example, medicine for cancer. Uh, sometimes we don't have uh, um, oxygen in hospitals. Uh, we don't have sterilizers for people to do operations. Um, no, we don't have uh, uh, oil uh, or gas in the winter, so people are cold. Uh, and of course, it's women who uh, try to bridge the gap and to try to create alternatives. And um, so it, it really put a huge burden uh, on, on Syrian women. But, um, you know, I, uh, the problem is that when I read Western press and um, the Americans say that they force more sanctions against Bashar al-Assad, they, uh, they, are, they are horrible measures against our livelihood, against the livelihood of every Syrian person. Uh, and it, uh, as I said, it is uh, without women, you would not have the families together. Uh, women are the ones who are taking care of the children, who have to feed them, who have to keep them warm, who have to look after their parents, uh, you know, not only after their children, but also after their parents, who have to make it in the uh, family, in the uh, village in the city, wherever. Now you go anywhere in Syria and you find mostly women working in agriculture, working in industry, uh, working in, in every domain. So these measures taken by the United States, if there were any law in the world, they will consider them criminal measures uh, taken against innocent people who did nothing uh, to harm the United States or to cause um, this uh, horrible suffering uh, for the Syrian people.